What is up guys, Percocet Productions here, and today we're going to be ranking the Red Dead Redemption 2 Legendary Outfits. So there is about 16 of them, if I'm correct, but let's get into it. Alright, just to be clear, we're not ranking like the, the items individually, like the hats or the jackets, we're actually ranking the full outfits together. Right. So I'll start us off, uh, mine is actually going to be the Bronco Buster as number 16. Honestly, I look at this and it, it's just, it's nothing special. It's literally just like a jacket. Nothing that stands out about it. You know, there's nothing that makes it unique. And I, I don't know. It's just very bland and very boring for like a legendary outfit, you know? I gotcha. Okay. Uh, I'll shoot with my number 16. My number 16 is the trophy buck. Um, okay. I just feel like it's kind of ugly. Um, mm -hmm. Like, so you got the pants. And the pants just look like, what the hell is going on with this fur pants? And it just doesn't fit. And then, like, the raccoon hat is pretty cool. Um, but, but it like, doesn't fit. Yeah, nothing fits. It's like, they just threw this together. These were, like, the leftover pieces, yeah. and they just put them together. See, I actually am pretty on par with that. I actually put the trophy bucket number 15. And literally for everything you said, it's so mismatched. <laughs> nothing matches. Like, it's just, it's a jumble. Ugly as it, hell. Yeah, it makes no sense at all yeah. no sense well my number 15 is the beast of prey um another weird one it, it kind of looks similar to the trophy book actually in terms of like and the beast of prey you got the fur pants again you got the feather cap that's kind of cool i like that but that's about all that i like again there's really not much going for it i mean very just weird i don't really like the fur pants the super duper mm. fur pants i don't really go well with any of them right right my number 14 is actually going to be the dream catcher uh -huh. um, very mismatched and very disorganized like <laughs> it's it, it's just not good you know what i mean like for some reason there's you know bright feathers on the hat with bright white fur pants like it it's just it's ugly <laughs> Yeah, it's really ugly. <laughs> it is ugly. So my my next one, I actually have the Huntsman. Um, Ooh, okay. at number fourteen. So you got the mountain hat. I like the coyote hat. That's pretty cool. Something mm. about it just doesn't feel that really smooth. I don't like the boots. Um, the gloves mm. are okay. They're just gloves. You got some chaps and you got a coat. Um, it's okay. I just don't think it flows well. You got you got like a you got, you got a, going top to bottom of the outfit. You got black, gray, yellow, then blue, then like some grayish metal orange. Just don't mm. think the colors flow together real well. Okay. Yeah, I can I can definitely see that. You know, it's I'm detecting a pattern here. Um, yeah. So my number thirteen is actually gonna be the Mountain Man. There's a little more cohesion here than the the last couple. But again, I think it's very ugly. Not really a fan of the Grenader hat too much at all. The jacket is very like pompous and it's very like in your face. And like the white gloves, man. What, there's nothing else white in this outfit. What the fuck? <laughs> It's just, it's it's dumb. Most of these most of these legendary outfits are ugly, but there are some good looking ones. My next one is one that you mentioned earlier, the Bronco Buster. Again, the really like gray, like kind of brownish color palette here is just a little mm. boring. Um, other than that, I mean, you got the pigskin gloves that are kind of cool. The hat is just a basic hat that you could find anywhere. I feel like. Yeah, you said pretty much everything about it. There's nothing really unique about this outfit that you couldn't really catch in story regular outfit right, please right uh number 12 for me was the wrangler not the night wrangler the regular wrangler mainly because the jacket's ugly as hell <laughs> i don't like the jacket at all i think it's absolutely <laughs> disgusting the hat is also very ugly i don't like flop hats at all yeah. i think that it's stupid and i mean it's just i mean the colors kind of go together like the hat and the skin yeah but that's about it that's that's about it the rest of it's just bland yeah i'm not too far off on that one i will mention that in a little bit um, but next up, the dream catcher for me. I put it a little bit higher just because I kind of like the hat, actually. I like the beaver hat with the, um, like, peacock feathers looking thing. It's a, a, a flare of color that you don't see in a lot of, uh, anything really with this. Um, like, I would wear that hat just by itself. The rest of the mm -hmm. outfit is very mismatched. Mismatch. Mix-matched. Whatever. Mismatch. The... Mismatch. <laughs> <laughs> um you got some weird like gloves that are like gold and black and the pants mm -hmm. are just pants um they're certainly a choice but yeah okay my number 11 is the beast oh, of yeah. prey i like the top the gray vest i mean it's okay um the hat is okay 
But the pants, man, the fucking pants. <laughs> the, they're just ugly. They, they don't go with it. Dang. It could have been a good skin, but it ruins it. Ugly. It just doesn't belong. It's god awful ugly. It's literally like they just slapped the top on this, and it, it like I, yeah. I don't get it. I don't understand it. They like all the legendary skins or all the legendary outfits are supposed to look good. So far, all the ones we've talked about just are are mismatched and ugly as hell. I think the reason I gave it a little more love is because of the hat and the vest like matching, and they actually look good. But the pants are what really drives this one down. Right. My number 11, the Wrangler that you mentioned earlier. The only mm. reason I gave it a little bit of credit is because it has a look like that is unique. Like it doesn't mm. take really from anything else. I mean, you know, you got the um, the jacket, which is pretty unique, which is pretty cool. And um, the vest, it's something about it. I do like the floppy hat. I'm, I'm a fan of the flop hat. Um, but yeah, it's still not good. All it's right. Ten. So top 10. That's going to take us to my 10, which is the Huntsman. I like the hat. You know, the uh, the coyote hat is pretty cool looking. Um, the top isn't that bad looking. I don't like the gloves. The color of the gloves, that like brownish orange, is just, it just doesn't go with anything. And then the boots. The boots are the one that really drive this home for me. So ugly. Like a normal pair of boots would look great on this outfit. And it'd probably drive the value up a lot. But like they're just, they're not good. Yeah. And normally like. Honestly, the like pants are pretty much generic for almost all of them. So that's why I haven't even said anything about the pants because it's all just like blue jeans, basically. <laughs> so far, at least. Yeah, or fur. Um, yeah, or, or the ugly fur. The fur is really what drives yeah. the value down. Uh, my number 10 is actually the bear hunter. Oh, okay. Just because I feel like it's like the most basic outfit of like them all. Like it's like the plain Jane version of a legendary outfit. Like it just... I like it. I do like it, but it's just, it just feels really boring for some reason. You got some gloves, a coat, and the hat, pretty much. The hat's cool. You know, it's the bear, legend, legendary grizzly, of course. And the coat is like, I feel like that's a coat I could find in the general store. Doesn't really do much for me. Um, I don't really agree with that, <laughs> but we'll get to that one later. Uh, my number nine, I said the Rattler outfit. I feel like if you're going to have an uh, outfit called the Rattler, you should probably put more than just, uh, what is it called? More than just uh, snakeskin boots on it, you know? Like, that that's like the only thing here that actually has snakeskin on it. Because, right. I mean, the hat is a ram hat, the vest is pronghorn, and the gloves are iguana. Like, the only touch of rattlesnake you have on this is the boots right and again the vest is very basic the hat is ugly as hell i don't i don't like sombreros personally uh the gloves look cool being the iguana skin but again it's not not rattlesnake skin i don't know i i personally feel like if you're gonna call it the rattler it should have more more rattlesnake like that's the whole point but okay a missed opportunity yes very much missed very much my next one is the stalker um again we have the fur pants that i really really don't like um the jacket's okay i don't like the little pockets on the jacket with the like feather mm -hmm. effect on them um the hat is very it's just kind of ugly i don't like the color layout I, the fur pants again doesn't do much for me very similar okay, pattern okay. With the... um again not <laughs> vibing with that one too much but hmm. We'll get there. Mm -hmm. We'll get there. <laughs> so my number eight, I actually said the Desperado. You know, I like the hat. It's nothing really special. It just looks like one you could find in a store. But it's better than the sombrero or the flop hats because it, it looks like a decent hat. Mm -hmm. Um, The jacket is nice. The boots are really gaudy for this outfit. Like, they really don't belong with this outfit at all. That's true. Like, you look at them, these things look like they're supposed to be on a lot nicer of an outfit. And it's just not... It's just not meshing together well. Right. I'll shoot with my number eight. I have the Rattler. Um, just one nice. spot higher. I like the Sombrero, actually. Um, <laughs> I like the worn the som ass. Sombrero look. And I like the boots, too. They're very, uh, I don't know what to say. They're just unique, flamboyant. I like the boots. I do. I just, it's just not enough, man. Yeah. It's just not enough. I can see that, yeah. Uh, yeah, I still like the outfit decently i think it's decent to good like i wouldn't go on my way to get it but i do like it right right number seven i said the marauder same um, marauder now i really like the cavalry hat a lot actually and the jacket does remind me of like a civil war jacket it's the so chaps. It, it is very on theme i i was gonna say that the chaps <laughs> ruin it the chaps ruin it Shawn michaels chaps 
<laughs> dead ass. Just puts a little danglies on it, man. That's all. Yeah. The, literally everything about this outfit looks great. Even the 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 snake skin gloves. I mean, they look banging. The hat looks banging. The coat looks banging. The chaps. They ruin this outfit. Mm. I mean, they that that is the only reason this outfit is not in like the top three. For yeah. Me. I pretty much agree completely with what you said. Um, the yeah, yeah, the chaps are what ruin it. I don't like it that that much, but um, like the rest of it, I do like the vest. Mm -hmm. I think the vest is the best part. Um, but the chaps are completely disgusting. Right. Dirty chaps. Yes, that sounds like a slur, but we're gonna ignore that. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, number six is the death roll for me. I would think if you're gonna use the legendary gator skin. It would be a lot more, uh, like, I don't know, cohesive. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So, like, you know, you got your, the hat matches. The hat looks great. The gloves look great. The boots look great. I don't like the vest. I don't like the vest. Or cloak. Not the vest. The cloak. The, the fucking panther skin cloak. It does not match. Mm. Everything else on this skin is alligator. Why put a panther cloak? That is so stupid to me. Interesting. Honestly. Everything else on this looks great. You don't need the cloak. That's definitely an opinion. <laughs> <laughs> um, I can tell that one's probably your number one. Yeah. Um, my number six is the bounty hunter. Have you mentioned the bounty hunter yet? I have not. Okay. And there's a reason for that. Okay. The bounty hunter is my number six. I like the bounty hunter jacket. The beaver hunting jacket. I think it's very mm -hmm. slick. Sleek, sleek, and I like the sheepskin vest. Um, I, <laughs> I don't like the um, I think the gloves are kind of boring. I think the lower half is kind of boring as well. The the chaps are just like, what the hell are mm. those things down there? Um, but the vest is really cool, which I think is why it gets its spot. And I like the hat, I think, I think the hat is good, not great, but good. But the vest right. is the best part, okay? All right, all right. Um, we'll talk about that one a little bit later. Like, My number five. I actually said the uh, the Night Wrangler. Um, I do like it. That's why it's in the top five. Um, I like it. I That's do why like it's it. In the top five. <laughs> I think the one complaint I have is shut up, asshole. <laughs> um, I think the one complaint I have about the skin is the fingerless gloves. I kind of think they take away from it. You know, if it had a normal set of gloves, it would look a little bit better. I like the vest a lot. I like the hat a lot. You know, the the. Coyote Gambler's hat is pretty sleek looking. Looks fantastic. Coat looks fantastic. Pants, are, they just look like blue jeans again, you know. But the boots are a little, little meh. They're not really anything like special. But it, it is a lot more cohesive than, you know, the past couple that we've talked about. Mm hmm Yeah, I don't, I don't think that's a bad take at all. Top five. Mine is the Desperado. Again. Okay. Rockstar is really good at these vests, man. The Billy vest is very clean. Um, and they're really good at the uh, coat. I would say even. better at the uh, the wolf coat is fantastic. I love the fur at the neck line um, there, mm. and I think it's really good. I think the gloves are very good too. I think the boots are the thing that throws it off, which is the exact same thing you said. Yeah, the boots are just very weird and green tinged and like it just doesn't flow with the rest of the outfit like if you just cut off the bottom half pretty good right. very good even you just would have to change the pants and then the boots mm -hmm. okay that's definitely a take um <laughs> my number four i'm gonna say the bear hunter Ooh. um i like the skin because it fits together well and the fucking headgear is Mwah. fantastic i love the bear hat Magnifico. love the bear hat the vest looks great very fitting um boots actually match you know like th this outfit matches and it looks good it looks good matching i like the way this outfit looks it's nothing too flashy but yet you have a dead bear on your head you know it, what's more badass than having a fucking skinned bear on your head as a coat nothing i'll tell you what is better than that oh yeah let's hear it let's the watch your number man. four the mountain man number four <laughs> Nah, <laughs> you're so full of shit. <laughs> Yo, let me tell you, this Grenader hat is freaking... It's, you the, are, it's so cool. You're full of shit. There's Yo, no way. Like, tell me when you've seen a Grenader hat in uh, Red Dead. Never. Because it's like... Because I didn't want to. There's a reason there's not any <laughs> and in then there. The, the country vest? I was... I was 
I was fuming when you said the the white gloves Dude. weren't fitting. I was I was heated because it works so good with the vest with the jacket the, the coat like because the coat is like it's like dark gray at the top and then it gets whiter as you go to the bottom and then you have the white gloves. It fits. Sure, you could you know pick apart like the rest of it, but man, the the hat, the uh, coat, and the gloves they fit. And yeah, it looks stupid, but it's a good stupid. <laughs> and like, <laughs> it's a good stupid. Oh. Nothing is like I, this. I ain't, I ain't doing this. I only put it no. number four. Yeah, well, I'm. That's too high for me. Man, um, you don't know. All fashion. right, number three. Number three. I'm gonna say the bounty hunter. Hmm, pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, suck on that one. Anyway, oh, the bounty hunter. Very good looking skin. The the or skin. The outfit. I like the jacket a lot. The colors look great together. Mm -hmm. They match the boots. Fantastic. Already off to a great start. The gloves look great. You know, you don't need anything too flashy. You don't need them to be orange either. But the the one thing I think that drags this down for me, and it's probably one of the reasons I didn't put it at number one, is the hat. I like the hat, but I don't, again, I don't like hats that are like loppy. Like, I, I like the hats that have like a brim, a nice brim. And that's the shame of it is I don't like this hat on this outfit. I, yeah, I don't think that's a bad take. I have the Night Wrangler at number three. Where did you have it? You had it pretty high. Right? Night Wrangler? Yeah, you had it pretty uh, high. Five five yeah so the night wrangler for me number three it's very good um the boots are nice you got the moose chaps i like that that flows i like the coat the cougar coat um the hat is pretty good i think it's just a very nice cohesive outfit um the gloves are a little weird with the fingertips cut but that's about it i like the cuffs on the the jacket or the coat especially mm -hmm. um the vest and the coat kind of a little bit of a contrast there but i think it's still pretty good overall night wrangler i like it it's really cool actually okay not a bad take i mean i you know i had it at number five so not far off number two for me we're gonna say the stalker okay now oh i, I hated know, did this you... one you hated the stalker, right? That's I put what I this thought. Very low. <laughs> I wanted to make sure. Now, the reason I like this outfit, cohesion. It's all the same. <laughs> it all looks all... like shit. <laughs> now, shut up. Okay. The colors all match. Everything matches. Everything looks good. I granted, I'm not as big of a fan as the fur, but mm. I like the fact that it all matches. The hat, yeah, the hat is um, a little droopy, but it does have a brim on it, and it again, it's a nice slick white whitish whatever you want to say finish and it looks good it looks good together i think mm. you know i don't rock with fingerless gloves but again the fact that it it all is cohesive is fantastic it has nothing on my number one because i think the number one was very obvious for me but it it was it was very easily second definitely love this one now, if there's one outfit that you're going to walk into a saloon with and the entire place is going to look at you and go, who is that? It's the death roll. Um, Because, like, dude, the vest. The vest pops more than, like, any piece on the entire. The vest is a nice golden, and then you have the hat, which is, like, a little bit, you know, like, brighter, not the same color. And then you got the boots going with it honestly i think it's just a fantastic fit all around i even like the panther cloak uh that you did not like i like it mm. because it's just a nice touch it doesn't hide the gold too much it still allows the gold to pop and i think that all together i think the gloves is the only thing that ruins this from being perfect but i do really like the death roll um but my number one was a clear shot as well i wouldn't i think we have the same number one i think we do so uh for me and it probably you. It was the ghost bison. Mm -hmm. I mean, this outfit is sexy. You know, yeah. the jacket is beautiful. The gloves match fantastically. The boots. I mean, they're the boots are a little meh because I think they're like moccasins. But I mean, the headgear. The headgear is the best part about this outfit. Yeah, I just I thought it was very very beautifully put together and it looks fantastic. Yeah, the top half is like the cleanest thing that i've seen yeah. uh like the white gloves just flows with the white coat and the hat like i mean it yeah the elk gloves and then the white bison top piece is just fantastic i mean what more can be said about it it's clearly the best i wouldn't really argue but yeah i mean that's basically our list let us know how wrong we were in the comments below i'm sure you guys you know you all have your favorite outfits and uh yeah. let us know which ones were your favorite and your worst yeah and we'll see you guys next time